Joining me now is Mike Story from May River Preserve. Welcome, Mike. We're thrilled to have you with us today. Jenny, thanks for having me back. Appreciate so, it. You know I adore May River Preserve, and I don't get a chance to get out there very much. So please update us. You've got lots and lots of exciting stuff happening right now. What's going on? We do. A lot of building activity right now, new homes going up. Uh, we're down to only nine opportunities left in phase one. Wow. Uh, and we will be uh, beginning to introduce parts of phase two later this year. Uh, but uh, phase one Get is it while you can. well. It, yeah. that's, the, that's the point because as we all know, prices do go up as you go from phase to phase. So right. there's still nine really good opportunities in phase one. Well, and you're st there's still low interest rates. So you can take advantage of that. You know, if you interest wait for phase are great. two. Absolutely. Interest rates are still down. Uh, and as you know, there's no construction loans involved out there. We do all the financing on the build. Right. Uh, so it's, it's really a great opportunity for folks right now. Absolutely. Now, I heard a rumor there's, you've got a new model coming up, or what's going on? We do. Uh, this rounds out our portfolio at 10 different plans to choose from. Wow. Uh, that this seems is, like a lot of variety. It is. For a okay. small community of only 109 homes, yeah. we're trying to avoid the cookie cutter look. Absolutely. And I think this will help us do it. This new plan is called the New Field. Okay. And it's a wonderful uh, three bedroom, two and a half bath cottage, single story cottage, mm -hmm. two and a half car garage, uh, all the same great high end finishes. Right. Uh, but it fits that, fits that need for folks that are downsizing or folks that are just getting started and want a new home that's uh, it's a beautiful little cottage style that'll fit on either, either the lake or the wooded lots. Perfect. Uh, it's a great opportunity. Now, we talk a lot, of, when we're talking May River Preserve, you know, one of the things I think that makes it so uh, wonderful are the amenities, but you've got some excitement happening with regard to the amenities, right? We do. Okay. Uh, folks have been visiting with us over the past few months have seen the amenities coming together, coming okay. out of the ground. And uh, finally, uh, our pool is completed. Yay! Our party barn is up and ready. <laughs> And we're planning our first function there for our property owners. Okay. Uh, and then we'll be doing some public functions as well after that. But uh, we're doing our grand opening on the 19th of November. All right. And in accordance with that, we're having our first public open house. Oh, fantastic. On uh, November 22nd. That's a Sunday. Mm -hmm. And uh, we'll have models open for tour as well as the amenities. And sure, folks will come out and take a look. Well, and... I think what's great about that is that you, when you go to an open house, or you know, you can really experience the feeling of being in that community, because you know the one thing I think that's so great about May River Preserve is number one the location, because you get that kind of privacy and isolated feeling, but yet you're just a couple minutes from the store or school or you know downtown Bluffton, but. You, you also get to really experience what that community feels like, right, with the amenities and the functions? You'll get a great feel for the community, but you'll also get a great feel for how the houses live. Yes. Uh, how the space works, how does it flow, mm -hmm. how much light do you get in different rooms, all things that help people make decisions right. about what type of home is best for them. Mm -hmm. And uh, we hope to have at least three, if not four, models open on that, uh, that Sunday. Oh, fantastic. So I uh, hope folks will come out and, and take advantage of that opportunity to see the, the and homes experience. as well as the amenities. Yeah. yeah. Wonderful. Mike, as always, it's a treat when you're here. Thanks for keeping us updated on all the exciting things, and we'll see you in November at the open house. Jenny, thanks for having us back.